latest headlines and most accurate forecast from 41 Action News. I'm Caitlin Canute with 41 Action News. Here's a look at your headlines this Friday. In honor of Dr. Martin Luther King's March on Washington today, hundreds took part in the March on KC. It started at 3 this afternoon, downtown at 12th and Locust. The march comes as calls for racial equality increase across the country. Several local civil rights groups helped to organize today's march. Demonstrators are walking to the Liberty Memorial where that march will end. Today, a new order goes into effect in Douglas County. It bans bars from selling alcohol after 9 p.m. and makes them close no later than 10. It also prohibits restaurants from staying open after 10. The move comes as county leaders say they're trying to slow the spread of new cases ever since students returned to KU's campus, campus in Lawrence. And a tough task for the Chiefs this weekend. The team has to cut its roster down from 80 to 53. This year it's been a little more difficult for coaches since they didn't get preseason games to evaluate players. This is the final roster cut before the team's season opener on Thursday. Now here's Gary with the forecast. That's going to be difficult. More on that coming up over the weekend. Look at this, a cold front coming our way. The winds will be shifting to the north and northeast. Some rain, snow out over western parts of Kansas is a possibility. And we're going to have those rain chances going up, up and away Tuesday, Wednesday and possibly on Thursday. How much rain is going to fall? A lot in northern Missouri, possibly in Iowa. We'll be on the edge of this next week. Our forecast for the next seven days, 90, 91. Now Monday's the day of transition. The front might come through earlier, but right now we'll go with 92 falling to 63 Tuesday and 54 Wednesday with a chance of rain into Thursday. There's your forecast. Remember to get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com.